Chicago, big city, windy city, opinionated city. Whether you're from Hyde Park, Lincoln Park, or Wicker Park, why is everything a park? Their food is as iconic as their corruption. Al's Italian beef sandwich, Garrett's addictive popcorn mix, Portillo's jumbo hot dogs, and of course, the legendary Chicago pizza I've heard so much about. What the f is this? This is Chicago deep dish pizza. Yo, I said I wanted pizza, not some Italian guy's dump on a plate. This looks like me eating pizza and then throwing it up into a bread bowl and then leaving it in the sun to dry. This is how Chicago does pizza. I refuse to believe you can't get a decent slice of pizza in this city, all right? This is the birthplace of Lincoln, Obama, Michael Jordan. None of those people were born here. Brothers. Ugh. This is what people in Chicago call pizza? Why can't I find a decent slice in the city instead of this stupid bull? I couldn't find a single place that sold real pizza. Just these deep dish dough dumpsters. This isn't pizza. This isn't even human food. After hours of only deep dish, I finally found a place that served delicious, normal pizza pie. The Cook County Jail. That's right, the best pizza in Chicago is in the biggest jail in America. This gourmet pizza is actually made by and sold to inmates as part of a training program called Recipe for Change. Recipe for Change has made it a point to put together a program where we have phenomenal pizza. Thomas Dodd is the sheriff of Cook County Jail. He's been running the pizza program for four years. We have a lot of good pizza in Chicago. This is really good, though. What do you mean there's good pizza in Chicago? Have you tried that deep dish yeah. Chicago pizza? Yeah, but the, in the inmates didn't want that. So you're telling me even in jail, people did not want deep dish pizza? They haven't been asking for it. Recipe for Change is one of several rehab programs at the Cook County Jail, along with drumming, painting, chess, gardening, and more. So what made you become a hero sheriff and not a Joe Apio sheriff? You know, recidivism rate's like 70%. It's expensive to incarcerate people. It's not expensive to give them a skill. The man giving them that skill? Local restaurateur, Chef Bruno Abate, who volunteers his time and expertise to teach inmates how to cook the best pizza in Chicago. Chef, what do you think about this deep dish pizza? It's, uh, it's garbage. People should not eat this. It's uh, like a brick. Look at this, look. I mean, I don't know where you buy this. I don't want to know. But this is shame. After a straight hour of shitting on deep dish pizza, Chef Bruno finally got around to telling me more about how his program is affecting inmates. The program Recipe for Change is here to open your mind, to open your brain, give you hope, give you self-esteem, give you dignity. Give you pizza. Everyone in the Cook County Jail wants to be a part of this great program. I learned how to be a um, better leader. I learned more how to work with a lot of other people. I basically, I've learned how to eat better. It was great to be with people in Chicago who understood what pizza is supposed to look and taste like. Guys, this pizza is genuinely awesome. You must have people lining up around the block to buy this. Actually, it's only for inmates. Guys, we gotta rescue Chicago from that bull deep dish pizza. Look, okay, I know the pizza is great, but this is not how you deal with conflict. All right, I'll be right back. Hey, where are you going with the pizza? Ronnie knew pizza this good wasn't meant to be caged. He also really loved prison escape movies. Ronnie, where are you? Look at the mess. Sei un ladro di pizza. Guarda che in October 2017, Ronnie Chang smuggled thin crust pizza out of Cook County Jail. Oh, Ronnie loved pizza, but he also hated Chicago deep dish. He had to find a way to get thin crust pizza to the people of Chicago. All it takes to get pizza out is cheese, dough, and time. That and a big ass poster. Ronnie Chang who crawled through a river of marinara and came out smelling like basil.